But we begin with breaking news tonight at 10. A large police presence with SWAT teams in Waukesha. This happening right now at Douglas and Garfield, not far off from where Waukesha South High School is located. Our Waukesha County reporter, Brett Lemoyne, live on scene. Brett, we know this is still a very developing situation. What can you tell us? Yeah, Mary, within just the last 15 minutes or so, we saw what appeared to be a tactical unit mobilizing and moving on foot down Douglas. If you take a look here, you can see quite a number of squads that are on Grand Avenue right now. Uh, we have been moved back to Roberta Park, which is just about a block away. We were told by officers that was for our safety. Police have a home near Douglas and Grand surrounded. There is a tactical vehicle outside the front of the house. There's also a canine unit here from New Berlin. Even from where we're standing, we can hear officers on a megaphone commanding the person inside to exit the house. It is not clear if anyone else is inside. A neighbor told me this has been going on for about an hour or so. I asked an officer earlier if there was anyone dead inside the home. He could not say. Uh, but Mary, one thing of note here we should point out in the 40 minutes or so that we have been on scene, we have not heard any loud bangs, any indication uh, that there's been any gunfire exchanged. Can't speak to what happened before we arrived, but uh, within the last 40 minutes or so, uh, it has been relatively quiet with the exception of that megaphone. Uh, we'll stay on scene until uh, this is resolved and bring you the latest as it develops. But for now, we're live in Waukesha. Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News. All right, we'll look for updates as warranted. Brett, thank you. More